So we develop and sell algorithm sensors and IoT systems. Basically, they follow the mobility of an individual. And with these offerings, we're able to build capabilities such as screening and rehabilitation. And together with our partners, uh, Ario Huntley and Legrand, we aim to make a significant difference to the uh, elderly care market. So with an aging population, the independent life is critical. And we contribute to this by identifying risks and by uh, introducing uh, actionable insights to the caregiver and healthcare professionals. Uh, the uh, numbers shown here, they refer to the number of individuals affected by fall injuries in Europe uh, every year. Our journey goes back over a decade, actually. We started with deep tech uh, the collaboration works with institutions such as RISE and Lund University. In 2022, our first product reached the market. This is a fall detection algorithm. And we are uh, proud to say today that we have sold so far over 60,000 units. For 2025, we aim to extend the range, the target group as well as the value chain. And at the um, uh, crucial for this, a prerequisite is our own device, the Snublometer, which is a wearable, a patented device that follows the activity levels and the mobility patterns of an individual. And we have shown that our device outperforms the activity trackers on the market when it comes to uh, walking patterns uh, that are, are uh, typical of an aging person. So uh, in this example, uh, you can see how the uh, number, number of captured steps for our device in black and the uh, Apple Watch device in uh, gray, there is a significant difference for the weakest uh, walking patterns that involve uh, mobility devices. So, uh, in, in, for the weakest persons, we capture, we keep capturing about 100% of the step uh, cycle. And uh, activity devices out there, like the Apple Watch, they capture close to 0%. So, we argue that the activity trackers on the market are uh, not uh, sufficient to keep track of an aging person's mobility. So there are a number of pilots ongoing that involve our product, the Snubblometer. Four of them uh, are listed here. Three of them are actually commercial, so we make money of them, which is nice. Uh, and the, the real value, the biggest value of the pilots is obviously refining and validating our solutions. Our solutions not only capture information, present information. So with AI-powered algorithms, we are able to de de detect uh, uh, warning signals and to deliver actionable insights to the caregiver and healthcare professional. And this typically results in interventions involving medication, mobilization, and uh, physiotherapy. So this is an example of, of proactive uh, elderly care, identifying risks before they lead to dangerous falls. And summing up, I'm happy to announce that we will open shortly a pre-IPO for Infonomy. The objective obviously being to finance the launch of the mentioned product, but also we need to increase the number of our shareholders. Uh, current major owners include Ario Huntley and Jöran Lindahl of ABB fame. So we are confident in our ability to deliver value to the investors. Uh, for any questions concerning the pre-IPO, you may con uh, contact Infonomy or Villant Capital who are running it for us. And for any questions, please reach out to me directly. Thank you. Thank you, Helmut. Before you leave, I just have to know, will you keep Snublometer as the product name internationally launching? Yes, we, we will probably not launch it. We will be an OEM product internationally. Uh, it works very well in Sweden. It's the perfect balance between uh, humor and uh, sincerity. I agree. And, but outside, we, we will and already have actually uh, changed the name. Yes. What is the, uh, the other name? Uh, I, I can't say if we're actually allowed to tell you right now. Uh, so, but That's we're an OEM in, in that um, partnership. It will be the best kept uh, secret until uh, we, somebody knows. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you.